Okay, so combos with Makomo are very flexible, but unfortunately they don't do much damage. So most of the time you're going to be playing into your strike throw character archetype and just fishing for different ways to grab your opponent in different ways to make them terrified of you and your strike throw game. So basic BMB combos with Makomo could look something like this. Oops. You can dash up after a water wheel for free. You just have to leave a little bit of a gap or else it will cost you meter. And just do a few hits. And then do this and go into a grab and 3200 damage plus a grab is about half of the opponent's life on Sabito who has, you know, average life. And that's really, really decent damage for a low damage character like Makomo. So as long as you're implementing resets into your combos, you're going to get really decent damage. So with that said, combos can look something like this. Off of a raw water wheel, you can actually spend quite a lot of meter and get some damage like this. And get a- oof, I was even too fast on that reset there. This one's practically unavoidable. So if you did that grab a tiny bit later, it would have hit and would have been over half of the opponent's life. Off of a red attack, you can do um, combos and do a very similar stuff. Let me do a full charge one. to 3,700 damage into a grab, well over half of the opponent's life. And the same goes for her aerial combo, except it's a little bit more inconsistent, so I like to just go for the specials. It's a little less damage, but it's the same principles. You also obviously have the option of ending any combos you do in a water wheel for a hard knockdown to build back a bunch of meter, since you'll be spending a bunch of meter in your crazy cash out combos that we just showed. To combo into her ultimate, she doesn't have many opportunities to do so, so you're mainly going to be using it as a counter tool, because you can only combo it into it from the very beginning of her attack string like this, or at the very end. You can either combo it from her regular Beyblade attack string, or her up attack string, which ends a little bit sooner. So if you don't have much time left in your combo, I suggest going for your up combo, because it only takes about half of the time. You can combo off of her guard special in the same way you were comboing off of anything else, just by comboing into water wheel, going into the air, doing a few attacks, suffer slash, and getting a reset off of it. Any of these resets can be replaced with an armor attack or a grab, the grab is very consistent, and if you are in surge mode, well obviously you could be doing stuff like this. Very easy to get huge damage with her in surge mode. Because you just do this over and over again, you can get about 7,000 damage and then cancel into a grab and your opponent is dead. So that is Makomo and her combos. They're pretty simple, but as long as you're implementing her, her crazy grab and reset game into it, she'll be doing decent damage. Anyways, that was a quick combo video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye! <laughs>